I'm out here in the barn and we're continuing with our Tool Tuesday thing. So I'm going to give you the rundown of some of the things that we use here in the barn. The first that we're going to go over is this right here. And this is my drying rack. It is a homemade drying rack. If I had to guess, I'd say six foot. I'm five something, that's six. Um, it's just braced with little one by twos to slide my things in the same one by twos make my racks um, and the bottom is screen so if you're looking wondering what can do that it's not metal screen it's like cloth screen screen to go through your windows so um these all measure uh, less than two foot wide it's like i think 21 inches i built it so it's pretty simple it's just you can see here's the crossbar and there's a crossbar down there and it's that simple and then crossbars there and then these are held together all the way across so um the two front and back use and then i put the one by twos all the way across so that is all there is to it and like i said these are and i think these are like six inches apart or something i'm not real sure but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven racks. So, a uh, little tip on this if you decide you're going to build one. The screen comes three foot wide, and so you'll have this one foot all the way. I used a sewing machine and nylon thread and just seamed it right up. Um, and because it's not on this side, it's not anything, nothing going to snag. You can hose them off, it doesn't hurt them, anything like that. So. Um, anyway, there's a drying rack, homemade, it is what it is.